I absolutely hate it. Ew! Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back. Today, we're going to be watching a very requested video, and that is Midsummer. After my horror movie reactions, and especially Hereditary, you guys have been asking me to watch Midsummer. It's a scary movie. You guys have been wanting me to watch this. I get requests for it a lot. Every single time I ask you guys what you want to see, a lot of people always say Midsummer, and every single time I post a video and I'm like, new video, everyone wants it to be Midsummer, so I decided to do it for you guys. Midsummer is similar to Hereditary in a sense that it was a film that I really wanted to go see because people claimed it was really good, but because I'm scared of horror movies, it prevented me from watching it. Not prevented me, but it made me less likely to watch it, so I decided um, this is a great way to watch the movie and also give you guys a movie commentary that you guys have been wanting. So yeah. Unlike some of my other movie commentaries, I have no idea what Midsummer is about. I've heard about it, heard that it was good, heard that it was scary, heard that it was culty, I think. I don't know. When I first saw pictures for it, I thought it was about a sorority, so that just tells you where my mind's going. I thought it was about a cult sorority that went bad, so... I have no idea what's gonna happen. <gasps> it's like the beginning of Shrek. <laughs> it was just a, it, <laughs> it was just a phone ring. It, Guys, I am not made for horror movies. I'm really not made for them. It's Danny. Uh, I'm sorry to be calling so late. I'm just checking in. What happened to her parents? Sure everything's okay. <gasps> Are they dead? Um, Did they get recruited for a cult? Listen, I got kind of a scary email from Fucking, Terry I don't want to watch it. This looks like it's going to be scary. Anyway, Ew, I don't want to uh, watch I, it. I'm I so, just got a little worried, I'm so, so sorry. It's really... Canada, of course, Ew. Uh, yeah. Um... I have emailed her three times and still no response. So well, I know why she's not responding because who the fuck opens their email? I'm sure, it's fine. Send that bitch a text. Yeah. An email. Um, who the hell is gonna open an email? Not me. Pushing up the nerve to say something. So be direct. Confront him. What if I've scared him though? I'm always roping him into my family crap. How do you rope him in? I'm always leaning on him. Like I even called him today in tears because my sister wrote another stupid, scary email. That's what he's there for. Ooh, I love that. I love that little effect they just did. I mean, not effect, but that was cool. How it goes in the, it goes into the mirror and it gives you a little trick. Oh my God. He's gonna pick she it up and it's not gonna be her, or it's gonna be her oh, saying some weird stuff, or it's gonna be her really breaking abuse. up with her, him. <gasps> did her whole family die in a car crash, or just her sister? Or a burning house? What? What is? Oh, this is a house. What is that? Oh god, this is awful. This is so fucking creepy. I know that's the whole point. It's designed to do this, but god, I don't like it. People like watching movies like this. Just that, just fucking creeps them out. Jeez. Die. Oh, what the hell? They put it straight in her mouth? What? Ew! I fucking hate this. I fucking hate this so much. This is... Disgust. Dude, I can't handle this right now. I really can't handle this. I don't know what the fuck it's zooming in on, but I don't, I don't even wanna, I don't even wanna look at what it, the fuck it's zooming in on. I'm scared. And I feel weird right now. And I know, I know that's the point, but it doesn't 
make it good. It doesn't make me feel any better that I know that's the goal that they're trying to fucking whatever. I don't know. I'm scared and I feel weird. Cool. Not straight, straight though, right? We gotta go through Stockholm to get there. No, it's the opposite direction. Stockholm is south of London. Guys, it's Danny. She's coming up. They really do be, do be, do be hating her for like, no, being sad that her family died. Um, I invited Danny to come to Sweden. Yes. So you guys know. And she's not actually gonna come, but I invited her just to not make it weird. I, she's coming. It's a party in Sweden. Hey, Pele. <laughs> What were you drawing? Uh, just a table. Oh. <laughs> He's suspicious. The Swedish man is suspicious. The Swedish man is suspicious. The suspicious Swedish man. The suspicious... The suspicious Swedish specimen. Yes. The suspicious Sweden special, the suspicious Swedish special specimen, the special, the suspicious Swedish special specimen, the suspicious Swedish special, the suspicious Swedish message. Yeah, C C Christian says you've got this special week plan. Yeah, it's sort of a crazy nine-day festival my family's doing. Lots of pageantry and uh -huh. special, special festival. Fuck that. Yeah. It'll probably be a, very silly, but a small community is suspicious. Yeah, a festival is suspicious. Whoa, who's that one? That's last year's May Queen. <laughs> Beautiful. You know, uh -oh. I'm very, very glad. Oh, what the hell? He's recruiting. I, I think it's very good. Job. I bet you are suspicious, Swedish special man. I was so very sorry to hear about your loss. Oh. What happened? I mean, I can't even imagine. Bitch, you're the reason for it. Don't even try to deny it. You're the you're the suspicious Swedish man right here, and I know you were part of it. Sorry. No. No, I'm sorry. No, you're fine. I'm gonna just go to the bathroom. Thank you. Ooh, I love a good overhead shot. Ooh, I love that transition, too. That was tight. Oh my god, but I love... There's something about an overhead shot like that that I can't help but love so much that is amazing i don't know why i love it it's just it's almost simple but it's so trippy to me and it kind of makes you it kind of shows that the movie's having a dark turn right now i mean it has had a dark turn throughout the entire thing but it kind of represents that everything is kind of switching right now and things are about to get fucked up because it's like the world turning upside down I don't know if that's what it is. That's how I interpreted it. You can interpret it however you want. I love overhead shots like that. I love it when they come back um, to right side up. Something about it is so simple yet so pleasing to me that I really like watching in a film. I'm sorry, I'm not a film major. I don't know anything about films. Don't fucking roast me for that. I just really love those shots. Like I liked it in Hereditary, they did in Hereditary. Um, there's a movie called Assassination Nations where there's a shot just like that and I really love it. I do kind of like a horror movie having such a visually like angelic look to it it's really bright bright colors i think it actually enhances the um scary factor of it darkness is scary and um that sort of aesthetic i guess to the film will make a horror movie really scary but i think having the contrast between this light and dark thing going on with visually very almost angelic light it's full of nature and it's just really kind of beautiful but with a very eerie soundtrack that is very almost dark at sometimes is kind of a good way to enhance um your scary factor i think a lot of people think it would bring it down but i think it enhances it because i'm pretty fucking scared but i'm also scared of everything are we all gonna wear white because that's kind of 
too similar to some other cult festivities, you know what I mean? Some and why is there a K right there? There's like a little K in that thing. The little Deathly Hallow sign, there's a little K right there. Why is there a K? K's for cult. Turn off that flash, bro. We know what happens when you leave the flash on. Why isn't anyone standing like a normal human? Who's the kids playing? Skin the fool. Skin the fool. Yeah. <laughs> Don't tell me that's how they're gonna die. They're gonna be the fool that gets skinned later on. And then from uh, 36 to 54, we're a working age, which is fall. And then finally from 54 to 72, you become a mentor. What happens at 72? So at 72, even if you're perfectly healthy, they're just like, the season's over, bitch. Die. That's brutal. You're of no use anymore at 72. Bye. Uh, every midsummer we have this dance competition and the winner gets crowned. They shouldn't be called May Queens, they should be called Dancing Queens. That's perfect. You all have to dance to Dancing Queen every single year. And whoever gives the best performance will be the Dancing Queen. But you were only allowed to play Dancing Queen by ABBA. Any other song? It's not acceptable. She's a beautiful nose. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. And is that baby supposed to represent something? I feel like there's a lot of hidden Easter eggs, if you will, in this movie, and I am oblivious to all of them. Because guess what? According to the internet, I am stupid. And y'all will not let me forget it. What's tomorrow? First of the big ceremonies. At the stupa. What's that? I'm sick of this guy asking the other guy questions and then the Swedish guy just like saying the, the first thing that comes to his mind. He's like, obviously it's the first cer ceremonies. And then the other guy's like, what? That's happened like three times by this point and I need it to stop. You're there to research about this festival. Whoa. Whoa, that looks so cool. Honestly, quite stunning. Why wasn't this up for any Oscars? <gasps> Are they dying? Are they older than 72 and they're just gonna bite the dust right now? <sighs> they really looked at each other like, <gasps> what'd you just say? <gasps> Who, are you? Who are you? So raise your glass if you are young In all the right ways of my other dogs We will never be, never be anything but loud Or nitty gritty dirty little freaks I wish they started singing that Are they getting thrown off the top, brother? So they were following them, because it's like their last meal, so it's like they were the ones that everyone was just following their leads because it was their last meal. And they're over 72, so they're about to get launched off this thing because that is the cutoff. Oh, she's gonna be like, no, don't do it! And they're gonna be like, bitch, you ruined the ritual! Why would you do that? She's gonna be like, why is she jumping off? And they're gonna be like, no, this is our culture. Bitch. Whoa. Ew! Ew! I'm blurring it out, but the fucking flaps of skin that they just showed her bouncing off of that rock, her face, it was like flaps. Why didn't you- t Oh my god! Her head looks- Oh my god. If you knew the ceremony, why wouldn't you fucking tell them? No! Rev didn't die on impact? Jesus Christ. Oh my god. 
so they moan with him until he dies. So right when they kill him, they're all gonna stop because he's in pain, so they're in pain. That was... Graphic. They're all gonna do it, bitch. Why are you all doing it? The first one got him just fine. I, d I don't know. I don't know why. I don't okay, know why okay, I'm okay, here. Okay, I don't fine, know. Okay. And I can't... Come on, no. Come on, sit down then. Is he gonna kiss her? <laughs> My parents, they yeah. burned up in a fire and I became technically an orphan. He's like slightly grinning right now. And I know what it's like because I do. I really, really do. Why is he kind of grinning? He looks a little happy. By a family. A real family. Oh god. Don't tell me he's like, join the real family. Which everyone deserves. You deserve it. Mm-hmm. You deserve it. Join the cult today. That's amazing. That was weird. I didn't like that. Ah, I don't like it. I don't want to watch it. Please, it's scaring me. Oh, God. Oh, my God. This scene. Ew. Oh, my God. Ew, 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 ew. Ew. Fuck that. I need to widen my vocabulary, but fuck that. I hated that. Today's only train leaves 90 minutes. It takes about 35 minutes to go there and back, so they didn't want to waste time. So I could have sat on his lap? Yes, I mentioned that too, but you know, we, we don't break traffic laws. We break a lot of other laws, but you know, traffic laws we abide by. Gone. <laughs> this is bullshit. This is bullshit and you're gonna die for yelling at him. Simon's already dead, I can already tell you that. And how are jobs or roles assigned? That's based on traits we show us kids. <laughs> That's based on traits we show us kids. All right, Divergent. All right, Sorting Hat. Tell me where I belong. Thank you for your candor. I'm a Dauntless. So uh, the elders must approve mates. Cousins can sometimes mates, but we do respect the incest taboo. <laughs> We respect the incest taboo. I wish everyone did, to be honest, but some people be acting crazy over there in certain states, certain regions. I wish we all respected the incest taboo, but we can't always get what we want. Not clouded? No, no, no. Uh, Reuben was a product of inbreeding. All of our oracles are deliberate products of inbreeding. Y'all just said you thought you respected the incest taboo, but now you're saying it's a deliberate product of inbreeding. That just don't make no sense. That something is not adding up right now. Ew. Oh my god, dude. What the fuck? Is that what is a that? pube? Is that a fucking pube? <gasps> Ew. Oh my god, she made a custom one with a pube in it. Girl, what you doing putting all those pubes in other people's dishes? Who's sleeping with their shoes on? You finna go on a walk later? He's going on a walk later. Or he's ready to leave at any time. At all times, he's ready to get out of there. And I respect that. With Flash, dummy? Are you dumb? You. Are you dumb? Who was that? What the fuck, Mark? That's not Mark. Close the door. We're not supposed to be in here. Oh, <gasps> he's naked. He doesn't have pants on. Oh, shit. Wait, is that a mask? 
Someone got skinned. <gasps> Mark went off with the girl. They skinned him, took his clothes, and then did that. Who was wearing it, though? Was it a girl or was it a boy? <gasps> it's, um, tea for the competition. <laughs> it's tea for the competition. Vitamin C. Glee season one, vitamin C episode be like, oh no, it's vitamin D. Vitamin D be like. Oh, so they're supposed to like dance until they die, basically, you know? Oh, this is like a last to drop out wins type of thing, you know? So they gave him like a drug so they could keep going for hours and hours until whoever drops out. <gasps> That's fucking trippy. I hope she wins. You have been approved to mate with her. You're an ideal astrological man. Oh my God, when your signs are compatible. I love that for them. I think I ate one of her pubic hairs. Sounds probably right. That, now that, that sounds right. That sounds about right right there. Do they get paid if they become a match? Like, is it like donating your sperm, sort of? Oh, do the drug, do the thing that they like drank do something to them? That'll make them like drop out? Like it makes them dizzy? Or like they, they're getting dizzy obviously from spinning around and stuff. Dude, that's just dirt water at that point. <laughs> I, I swear you guys just what is it? took some flowers and some dirt and put it in the water. <laughs> Yo, someone with a flower crown could tell you anything that leaves do and you'd be like, yes, okay. Yo, I love musical chairs, but not, you know? You fight to the end of those musical chairs. You push those bitches over. <laughs> we found our May Queen. Yes! May Queen! Cause you are the dancing queen. Young and sweet. Only 17. Best time ever, to be honest with you. Like, if I went to some random, like, religious ritual and I won it, I wouldn't be so opposed to joining. Like, imagine you go to a Scientology, like, ritual and you win the dance competition. I'd be like, well, fuck it. I guess this is me now. Like, I'm amazing. I'm God. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, look at her flower bumping in her head. Oh, now it's like this is her family, you know? Like, she doesn't have a family, so this is her new family, and she's gonna be stuck there forever. Oh, I see those freaking flowers moving. It's so subtle, but I kind of like it, because it shows that, like, something's going on. Oh my god, naked women! Why are there all the naked women there and her? I can't even include this part because they're all naked. But I will say that they are all naked. And they are humming. And she is sitting there like freaking Eve. Adam and Eve eating the forbidden fruit. You know what I'm talking about? I can't help. Oh, they're all touching. Oh my God, I have to narrate this for you. They're all touching their boobs and like going, making noises. Interesting. I can't help but think this just reminds me of that scene in Ice Age where Sid the Sloth has like, he's like a leader of a cult and he doesn't know that he's a leader of a cult and they all do what he does. Like, am I not, I'm, I'm not the only one that could possibly think about that right now because it seems very similar to me. Oh my god. 
and she's their May Queen, so they're like, honestly, at this point, we'll die for you, bro. Oh god. This is like when you like try to like mock a baby while they're crying. Like it's just like it's such it's it like it's almost like a mind fuck. It's like what's going on? Like the baby's like what's going on? Oh god. Oh my fucking Oh my fuck. What the fuck there's a foot? Oh. Oh. And there's a rune carved into him. Oh god, I don't want to watch this. It's the chickens! Is he gonna get eaten alive by chickens? What the fuck? Wait, the chickens are eating someone. Who is that? <gasps> that's the last person that... Oh no, that's fucking... The London guy. I knew he died, but Jesus Christ. I can't even show this. Wait, he's still alive? His lungs are still working. But they're stretched. They're pulling out his organs. Fuck, what the fuck? Ew, I hated that. I hated the two eyelid thing. It, ew. So they, the other guy, they like carved open his back and they're keeping him alive. Hello, there you are. Listen, you can't speak. You can't move. All right? Good. What does he look like? Is his, are his organs coming out too? Because fuck. For every new blood sacrificed we will dedicate one of our own the four new bloods have already been supplied as for our end we have two already dedicated uh what the fuck and two who have volunteered ingmar and ulf all right volunteers that's great so the four was the two British people and then the two that they killed. That's fucked. Ew. Absolutely ew. The jingle bells. Fuck. Do it while he's alive? Oh my fucking god. I just can't catch a fucking break right now. <laughs> I don't- like, it's just so- I feel so... Disgusted and gross. And almost like I want to like throw up right now. It's really freaking me out right now. Like, I'm. I feel like stressed and anxious. And I know that's the point. I just don't like it. I really just don't like it.
please. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Absolutely the worst experience of my entire life. This is the scariest movie I've ever seen. I hated it. Absolutely hated it. What made you guys think to tell me to watch this shit? And I have to go back and edit it and watch it 10 more times. You guys are absolutely fucked. You guys are so fucked up for that. Why did you do that to me? This is by far the scariest movie I've ever seen. Worst movie. I hated it. I, it was a great film. No offense to the film. It was, it was amazing. It was amazing. The, the way it was made was amazing. Storyline, incredible. Epic. It is, the, the feeling I have right now is, I feel so disturbed. Like from the inside out, I am uncomfortable and I, I just need a, like a fucking hug or something right now. Like I feel disgusting. It's really hard to explain how I feel right now, but I'm assuming if you guys have watched the movie, you know that feeling. I feel like this is a true horror movie. Like the feeling it gave me, like not even hereditary made me feel like this. I know in my hereditary video, I was like, I don't know why I feel like this. Like, you know, I just feel so weird and anxious or whatever. This is like, this took it to a whole nother level. I don't know what about it. it scared me more. Maybe I wasn't screaming. Maybe I wasn't, um, you know, having big reactions like I do to say it or it's the only other one I've watched, but it's a weird feeling. Don't recommend it, but um, it's really different from say a jump scare horror movie like it is where it's not necessarily really scary, truly scary. Um, this is like, I guess really what horror is supposed to be. This was the scariest movie I've seen. A lot of people say Hereditary is the scariest movie they've seen. I thought Hereditary was less scary than this. Um, you let me know what you think. Um, I'm really surprised that this wasn't up for more awards. A lot of the times good horror movies get snubbed um, during award season because they are listed under the horror movies, but I feel like some horror movies are some of the best movies out there like I mean Hereditary and Midsummer are some of like they're really good movies that I've watched like out of the movies that I've seen like Hereditary and Midsummer are really good maybe I won't watch them again on purpose but I won't deny that they're good movies they have a really strong plot they're really well made movies they are stunning to watch. I'm going to be taking a break from horror movies because this one was a lot to handle. I hope you guys liked it. I won't be doing another horror movie until it's really worth watching because this one is going to put me out of horror movies for a while. I love you guys and I'll see you in my next video. Bye. <laughs>